Just a month before the upcoming legislative session begins, the bills are flowing in. With the Democrats firmly in control in the roundhouse, gun control will be front and center. Here's News 13's Rachel Knapp with a look. Gun laws and gun sales have been a reoccurring topic across the country and right here in New Mexico. In the run-up to the state legislative session, state Democratic Senators Richard Martinez and Peter Wirth have filed a bill that would make it harder to buy a gun. It says if guns are privately sold, the buyer must go through a federal background check, and if the gun is sold without one, the buyer and seller could be charged with a misdemeanor. And a House bill proposed by Democratic Representative Miguel Garcia calls for background checks for buyers at gun shows. Well, I'm for it. It's intrusive. That's the problem with this bill. Locals we spoke with have different opinions. And the reality is, is it doesn't stop or curb any kind of gun violence whatsoever. Andy Montoya, a firearms trainer and NRA member, says these laws aren't necessary because criminals will still get their hands on guns. They're stealing these, selling these guns. They're selling them for pennies on the dollar out in the street, in the black market. They're not going to go to a gun show and spend full price $500 for your average medium-sized gun when they can buy a stolen one on the street for 100 bucks. Others think the bills would help deter crime. And they can say, you know what, going through this background check, I don't really feel comfortable. You know, I'm, I'm not going to sell this gun. But both sides of this divisive topic agree New Mexico needs to lower gun violence. So this universal background loophole thing, is, it's, it's a farce, and it's not going to save anybody. I mean, I think, um, you know, there's just too much, too much violence in, in the United States with guns, and we need to somehow uh, have stricter laws about it. Rachel Knapp, KRQE, News 13. What isn't clear in these bills is how law enforcement would know if someone sells a gun without requiring a background check. We reached to the state, the three state lawmakers behind the proposed gun laws. None of them got back to us.